<laughs> Look, it's the Elder Scroll I'm using. Ah, uh, Paradox, man. Paradox? No? I guess the Elder Scroll can't see itself. Although, it technically is seeing itself because I'm seeing through it. But whatever. Alderaan approaches. Where is he? Because I was looking at him as a dead dragon. Oh, is that him? Or is that just a different one? No? I don't know. It doesn't look like the right color, but it could be him. Maybe he's that blurry one over there. Be nice if I could run around. Anyone? Anyone at all. Come on, do something for fuck's sakes. I don't want to sit here forever. Really? Dude, I think the game glitched. Did it? Did it glitch? Or are you finally doing something? No, that's a blood dragon. Right? What the hell's going on? Really? What the fuck? They're not doing anything. Is it all the ones approaching? Then just really? What the fuck? Real? Uh, hurry up, man! Get your ass over here! Oh, for fuck's sakes! I'm gonna have to cut out a big part of this fucking thing. Let's go ahead and cut this out. I gotta reload. I think I wouldn't, wouldn't the hell autosave. Really? God damn it. Ugh, motherfucker. Seriously? Oh, for God's sakes. <sighs> Welcome back to Skyrim, the modded playthrough. Uh, this is actually the second time saying that intro for this part of the playthrough because actually I went over to the throat of the world where I am going now. So let's go and fast travel there real quick. And I went up here and I read the damn Elder Scroll and everything. And the damn cutscene thing fucking glitched. So Alduin never landed where he was supposed to land. Nothing activated, worked right. It was just all fucked. Oh, God damn it. So let me go ahead and do a little save here real quick that way i don't have to return here so let's try this again i had to cut out a lot of the damn video just to get that motherfucking thing okay so let's read the elder scroll again there is no question and yeah i cut out the stuff that fucked up so you didn't actually see it because no need to see in it so there we are i'm here again this is not going to be in a window so basically, these guys are dragon warrior guys, and they're fighting dragons. This dragon's gonna get its ass kicked. There's supposed to be two more somewhere. I don't know where they are exactly. Uh, there's more dragons and bodies scattered around this place. Basically, using the Elder Scroll to look back in time, so I can learn the dragon rend shout. And the Dragon Wrench out, there's the second one. There's one more of them to show up. The Dragon Wrench out will actually let me force any dragon to land when I use it on them. That way they're not going to be flying around like jackasses and making it kind of a pain in the ass to actually uh, kill them and attack them and everything. Now hopefully I don't have to do this again because it's going to piss me off if this glitches. Hopefully... It works right, because I don't see why it would mess up. If it does mess up, then I don't know what the fuck I'm going to do. Because it's never happened before. So hopefully it was just a weird-ass random glitch and it doesn't happen again. And that's the third guy here, too, so yay. And why should he fear us even now? We blooded him well. Four of his kin have fallen to my blade alone. You're bragging about killing four, huh? Although there's one there. There's one over there and there's one behind me. That's only three, so I guess they were fighting at places other than here. But considering that there's dragons flying around too, it's not really a huge thing. And there's the Elder Scroll that I'm looking through, so yay. I never agree. But if you are right, no, not me. We we'll deal with Alduin ourselves. Fear it now. We shall see soon enough. Alduin approaches. Is that him? That's not him. Is it? Oh, oh, good. It didn't glitch this time. Thank you. Holy shit! Yeah, because he never actually landed the first time I went through this shit. That was annoying. So he's saying stuff. They're gonna use Dragon Rend. Soon, eventually. I guess they do fight him first and stuff, so. I don't know what's going on. Hey, look, some meteors! Oh, there he went. I just learned the. the, the shout from him, so that makes a lot of sense. There, see, it forces them to land. Awesome. What have you done? What twisted words? Haha! Um. I can't not hear them worth shit. Everything else is way too loud, this area. So I guess I can't feel bad about speaking over it because their voices are so loud, or so quiet, I mean, compared to all the 
background noise that's going on that it's kind of annoying. And let me see the audio settings because it's not like I fucked up the audio or anything. Uh, effects, footsteps, voices all the way up. So this is pretty much, I think this is nearly default settings. So I don't know what the fuck. Whatever. I could probably reduce stuff a bit, but fuck it. I'll forget to put it back up, then I'll be wondering what the hell's going on with the whole sound. If I die today, it will not be in terror. They all die. <laughs> uh, it's kind of sad, actually. It's kind of sad. All right, Elder Scroll. I think it's time for me to go back now. I, I, we we kind of realized what happened. They obviously all die and stuff. So I guess that yeah. See, so one's dead. The next one's about to die. And this guy's just backing up slowly. Going to the Elder Scroll. There we go. That's how he's getting sealed. That's how he gets thrown forward in time. Though what I wonder is, how the fuck did he escape if the Elder Scroll was still locked away in that one place that I just got it from? This is a little weird. I guess he wasn't locked in the Elder Scroll. I guess he was locked away in time. Some weird shit. <laughs> I guess the Elder Scroll is also awesome and indestructible or something because it just got burnt and it didn't get affected. Then what happens? Doesn't he drop dead or something? I don't remember. Or maybe... I guess he must be the one to hide the thing. I don't know. Oh, there's another guy that's still alive. I thought he died. It's getting blurry. Okay, good. I'm gonna go back now, finally. Awesome. So this is a waste of video, right? There we go. I've returned, so quick save. Motherfucking quick save. There we go. Hello, Paul. Oh, that's Alduin. Never mind. Defeat Alduin. Okay. Let's take that out and go back to Shouts. And I got a favorite Dragon Rend and attach Dragon Rend. So this is to defeat Alduin. But let's do this. Ha ha. You're just gonna fly there, right? No? Ha ha. Now I'm gonna have to. Damn. I'm actually near the end of the main stuff in this game, believe it or not. Awesome. I gotta kill Alduin. Even though, I guess not really kill him, but damn, I should have prepared for this a little more. I kind of forgot I had to actually fight him after getting the shout. Damn it. So, oh well. Oh shit, there's a dragon. Oh, that's Parthernax. I forgot. Did I miss? I miss. Damn it. I hate how long it takes for the dragon run shout to recharge though. And it would be nice if this was daytime so I could see, but I don't know if that's a scripted thing or not. So hurry up and land so I can shout on you again and force you to stay down. And actually start attacking you. There we go. I gotta keep using that. I'm not gonna use the full charge otherwise he may potentially have a chance to get away. Shoot once more and then use the shout. Boom, shout. Keep him on the ground. If he's on the ground, he's no big deal. Really isn't. He's kind of underwhelming. As long as I stay healed. And something, wow, I forgot he has that one shout that makes stuff. Okay, let me go ahead and use a potion, a potion, oh, food stuff, nope, okay. Uh, potion. Oh, wait, what scrolls do I have, actually? Summon undead, call to arms, no, so, oh, flame Art atronach, that'll be good. Use, and potions, where is a regeneration potion, because that'll be helpful. Also, heal, and regeneration, because he does not, not hurt me a whole lot, so... Let's go ahead and summon this Flame Atronach. There we go. That ought to help. And switch back to my bow. Where is my bow? There it is. Glass bow. And shout. Keep, keep all on the ground. Keep shooting. Oh, that wasn't a Flame Atronach. I thought that was... Okay, I guess it's not. That was a uh, Storm Atronach, actually. Shout again. Keep shooting. He's about half... Well, almost half dead, at least. Damn it. Fucking aim. Because it keeps using that damn shout. Unrelenting force on me. There we go. And I gotta heal. Otherwise I'm gonna die. So regeneration potion again. Even though I think I still had that in effect. Because 300 seconds is longer than I waited. So potion. Minor healing. And let's check scrolls again. Hysteria. No. Mayhem. No. Got an arm. 
Uh, let's see. Scroll of the Bane of Undead sets... Uh, whatever. Oh, that's for undead damaging stuff. Targets improve... Wait. Have improved combat skills, health, and stamina. No. That's to... That's a friendly scroll to use on friendlies and stuff. So I guess I have no other actual attacking. That kind of sucks. So I have to use my bow. No big deal. As long as this game doesn't start acting retarded. So he's almost dead. Over half dead. I just gotta make sure I don't shoot Parthenax on accident. I wanna keep him alive. And not have him fight me as well. Even though I have an option to kill him later. And let me go ahead and heal again. So potions. Where's potions? Here we go. Potions. Healing potion. There we go. He's almost dead. It's no big deal. This is not the final fight against him either. I still gotta go to Sovereign Guard. Which is basically the afterlife area. So he's getting there. And there we go. He's almost there. One more shot. Boom. Yeah. Haha, -ha, jerk. You're way too fucking quiet. Speak up, bitch. Firstborn of Akatosh, Malagi Zoklat. I cannot be slain here by you. Yeah, well, I'm still gonna kill you eventually. Maybe not here and now. We're on this uh, recording session. I want to play through, but recording session. But I will kill you eventually. And you're gone. Go free, motherfucker! I just beat you. And he ran away like a chicken. Even though he could have killed me if you just kept it up. So anyways. I'll go ahead and quick save here real quick. And actually that is the end of this part. If you guys enjoyed this video, feel free to let me know with a comment, like, subscribe, and or a share. And I will see you guys in the next part. Or some other video. But until then, I will see you guys later. Thank you very much for watching. And I will see you guys then. Bye.